Kim Love and his sister were born and raised in St. Louis. But from the age of three, the family vacationed in the Sheridan area at Paradise Ranch. During high school at Kimball Union Academy, Kim was the editor of the school newspaper and yearbook. After two years at the University of Virginia, he served two years in the Army. He then returned to the university and graduated with a degree in economics. After graduation, Kim married and his son Alex, now deceased, and daughter Betsy are pictured here. Through the years, Kim has enjoyed mountain climbing and fishing in Africa, deep sea diving, whitewater rafting in Chile, motorcycle racing, horseback riding, hunting, and skydiving. He has also renovated a fire truck used in Sheridan's Wyo Rodeo Parades. Kim moved to Sheridan in the early 1970s and purchased KROE Radio. At age eight years, Kim had traded a Lionel train set for a transistor radio, and from then on, there was no question what he wanted to do. Radio, he said, allowed him to become acutely aware of needs in the community and how he might extend a helping hand. That first station has grown to ownership of nine stations at a Sheridan Media and is today primarily employee-owned. Kim's recent purchase of Frackletons gives him one more opportunity to serve the community's needs donating proceeds from monthly dining for a cause. Kim married Mary Kay in 1998 and she quickly became involved with the philanthropy. Friends say that gentle Mary Kay has a calming influence on the occasionally cranky Kim. Thank goodness, they said. The two established the Kim and Mary Kay Love Family Donor Advised Fund with the Wyoming Community Foundation in 2002. And Kim serves on the board of the organization's Sheridan and Johnson County affiliate. The scope of giving has been extensive and various, including support for medical facilities, the senior center, the arts, the animal shelter, CASA Child Advocacy Program, and the Historical Society and Museum, among many others. They include personal donations, business donations, and services through Sheridan Media and foundation donations through the Wyoming Community Foundation. Kim was among the original donors to the Wyo Theater. One of his greatest loves, though, has been the Public Arts Committee, which he is instrumental in organizing, founding, and funding. His first donation to the project was the Bozeman Scout, standing proudly on the corner of Grinnell and Maine. It was the first of what has become over 75 sculptures in downtown Sheridan today. Included also is the sculpture of Bird Woman, dedicated to his mother and others who died in the plane crash of 1981. Kim and Mary Kay sponsor Sheridan Media's Christmas Wish Campaign. Last year, they granted 42 wishes, benefiting 23 families and 74 children. Kim serves now as trustee of Whitney Benefits and served previously on District 2 School Board, on the Wyoming Association of School Boards, the Sheridan County Chamber of Commerce, Salvation Army Advisory Board, Sheridan Wyo Rodeo Board, as president of the Lions Club, and on many professional organizations such as Wyoming Association of Broadcasters as President and Legislative Liaison with the National Association of Broadcasters. The Sheridan Senior Center Christmas Dinner made possible by the Loves ensures anyone in need or want of a prime rib dinner at the center. For many years now, Sheridan Media has sponsored the hour-long morning show Public Pulse with Kim as the host. An outstanding interviewer, he sometimes ruffles feathers, getting directly to the heart of the matter to provide open information to the public, a responsibility which Kim does not take lightly. Kim will tell you one of his proudest moments was receiving the Crystal Award for Excellence in Community Services from the National Association of Broadcasters. Sheridan Media Stations was only one of 10 awarded that year in the nation. In the meantime, their ranch, the Triangle S in Johnson County, is a refuge for the family. It carries many horses, a bison named Amos, Clyde the Camel, a star with Kim in the rodeo parade, a giant rooster named Drumstick, a miniature horse, a Texas Longhorn named Spur, several goats, and a well-loved dog named... Oh, and the guy can cook, too. Anyone for lobster? 
one can uh, do well uh, by doing good for the community. Uh, and it, it, uh, it uh, pays back in any number of uh, ways. You know, we've been lucky here at uh, KROE and Shared Media to have, have gotten, enjoyed tremendous support, you know, over the years from the community. And I think it's, uh, it just goes hand in hand with the efforts we've made around the community to be involved, to cover the community, and to uh, help organizations out in the community.